Good morning, naturalists, and welcome to Find Out Friday. We're trying something a little bit different this week. We're going to go on a bit of a virtual field trip, and then we're going to give you about half an hour to send in your questions while we show a live camera of our bird feeders. After that half hour is done, we will be recording our answers to those questions live. We will also be recording them and posting them to YouTube for those of you that cannot use Facebook. So let's go see what kind of decomposition we can find out here at ONSC. For this one, we even have a rope that will help us pull it to keep our hands from going underneath. What have we got under here? I saw a little beetle running away, but I don't see him anywhere. Oh, right here, we've got, there's a cricket. And we've got a little roly-poly, also known as an isopod, right here. Fun fact for you guys, these guys are crustaceans, like crawfish or lobsters. And lots more sprouts. Life is trying to come up from under here, even though it is covered with this piece of wood. That's all I'm seeing underneath this one. Let's check out our last cover board. And for our last one. Hmm. I'm seeing a lot of pine needles under this one. But you know what else I'm noticing? The ground here appears to be a lot wetter than the ground around the other side. Why might that be? All right, we're going to go ahead and put the lid back on this one. Actually, wait, I see a couple more things. I almost missed these guys. Well, there's a little tiny beetle over here. And if you follow my finger, there's a little ant that's running along the underside right over here. So sometimes you have to look up and not just down to find all of the really cool decomposers in an area. All right, I'm going to go ahead and put this piece back down as well. Here we can check out some aquatic decomposition going on at our pond. Now I wonder who might be under the water here. What do you guys think? And we're finishing our field trip right here in ONSC's classroom with our worm bin. Now this worm bin has been lovingly attended to by all the students that came out here since the start of the 2019-2020 school year. Students have added banana peels, spinach, and more to this bin. Let's take a look and see what's in there right now. Ooh, we've got some banana peels from my breakfast this morning. Let's take a look and see what else we can find if we stir up the soil just a little bit. Wow! Just like that, look at all those worms. And you want to know my favorite thing about this worm bin? 
can go ahead and pan up to me. It doesn't smell gross at all. What do you think that might be? I'm going to go ahead and let these guys get back to work because they are doing a very important job for us. But for the next half hour or so, go ahead and watch our live feed of our bird feeders and send us your questions at social media at onsc.us or post on our Facebook page. At the end of the half hour, we will go live to share the answers to that as well as saving it and putting it on YouTube later today for those of you that do not have a chance to check us out on Facebook. Thanks for coming along on our virtual field trip and we'll take your questions in about half an hour.